Hello viewers, are we here? <laughs> Sorry about that damn start to the stream. I think I had like three streams going on at some point there. So basically I wanted to start the stream and then it wouldn't start. So I had to restart everything. Then I went back in and it did start, but it started in a separate one. So everyone was sat in a different stream, which wasn't working whilst another one started. And then that one stopped. <laughs> We're here now, <laughs> thankfully. Um, I've missed, I've just missed the daily race, annoyingly. Um, but this gives us, this gives me time because what, 13 minutes ago, Boris Johnson uh, has given us some news about another lockdown. Let me have a look in the UK. Um, hmm, we must go into a national lockdown. Okay, that's exactly the, it felt like a lockdown anyway. So to me, there's no difference. Anyway, right, um, it's Monday. And you know what that means, daily races. Let's have a look. Um, so it's actually quite an interesting set of daily races this week. Uh, race A, group four at Tokyo Expressway. That's the one with the chicane of random chance and random death. That's going to be a horrific one. And then we have group four at Monza. 
that's again gonna be <laughs> you can see the chicane right there the chicane of random death and then uh, group three into logos this one's quite interesting because you have to use soft and medium so you have to do a pit stop something a little bit different but i have logged in as scott speed so i'm going to do each of these races once at scott speed and then um we can and then we can maybe go back to europe now i was thinking of doing race c from the back but at the same time i was thinking of i've got 15 minutes to try and set a good lap time so i think we'll set a lap time because i'm a rated now in america Could be quite a fun one from the back though we'll go from the back once from yeah we'll go from the back once and then thank you devon to john cheers bro yeah man good on mclaren Why don't I do Nations or Manufacturers Cup in full? I've, I'm have i doing the Manufacturers in full at the moment. Is the stream working properly, guys? Because I had problems setting it up. Well, let me just have a look. Got a normal amount of people in here. People seem to be able to comment. Seems all right. Um... Yeah, it's all fine. Okay. Stream's fine. Let's, um... I'm not going to set a lap, but what I'll do is I'll just test a few different cars. See what I can get. Because, um... Let's see what the America's top best times are. 28.5. What have we got here then? Genesis, F-Type. The cars here are a little bit different than what we're seeing in Europe. 4.5 Italia in there. I could actually get into the top 10 here. I can do a 28. 28.9. Screw it. Let's just, let's try and get in the top 10 while we're waiting. Um, screw it, let's do it. I'm, I'm going to use the Peugeot. Am I playing on PC? No. P um, Gran Turismo is only on PlayStation. Yeah, UK back in a full lockdown. To be fair though, I'm in tier four. What's the difference? I don't get what the difference is. Where I where I live, it feels like I was already in a lockdown anyway, so I don't think it changes anything for me personally. Right, if I get a 28.9, I'm in the top 10 in the Americas. I think I can do that. I've done it on my uh, Europe account. Thank you, Adrian. Yeah, Alex Albon is um, is going to DTM next year. I suppose he's got to do something. So fair play to him. Oh, you can't meet people outside. Oh, great. Well, lots more videos to make then, I, I suppose. Oh, I'm on the medium tire. So yeah, um, for those who are wondering, you can use soft tires. So in the race, for daily race here, you have to use soft and medium in the race. So you have to do a pit stop. Uh, there's lots of people asking about the strategy. You want to do about six or seven on each. So six on one, seven on the other. Um, you don't you don't really want to do more than that because of the tire wear. But you could probably get away with eight if you if you drove really smoothly. Is a direct drive? Is a direct drive worth it over a belt? Um, belt-driven wheel. I, I, I mean, direct drives are expensive. I would say they're only worth it if you're really going to play a lot. You know, if you're playing casually, like once every two weeks, it's probably not worth it. But if you're playing like every day and you take this seriously, then 
Yep. Yeah. Thank you, Lost Peterman, for becoming a member. Thank you, anxiety brain. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm getting horrific deja vu from last year at the moment. Well, thank you, Christian Candler. <laughs> More time to watch Super GT videos. The upside of lockdown. I'd still rather there wasn't a lockdown, though. Hey, thank you, Ricky Bob. Ricky Bobby. Yeah. Maybe not on Daily Race C, but on, on A and B, yeah. Oh, thank you, Andrew Gaines, for the tenor. Yeah. Although, to be fair, Daily Race C, there's a lot of car choice. I'm seeing lots of different cars being used for this one. Um, I think for A and B... It's very much like single make, but Group 4 is usually like that. Right, let's try and get a good lap time here. Um, at least a low 29. Thank you very much. Another donation. You guys. Come on. Oh, it's not quite going to be. Well, actually, it might be. It might be a 28. No. I go straight to the line. 29.006. Thank you, the king. <laughs> It'd be interesting to see how Alex does, to be fair. Uh, 29.006. Oi, uh, put me on the top 10. Wait, shall I go back? Oh, I should be on top 10. Thank you, DE. Um, when did I change the direct drive? Um, I think it was about halfway through. What was it? It was either about a year ago or just a bit over that. So late 2018, early. No, late 2019, early 2020, I think. Does it make you quicker? Or a more enjoyable experience, but not quicker. I'd say it makes me not necessarily quicker. Boom! Yes, Scott Speed, top 10. Get in there, Scott. Fantastic lap, mate. Yeah, boys. Look at that. Top 10 in the region. What was that, second lap? 29.006. Hell yeah. Um, I'd say the, wheel, uh, the direct drive doesn't necessarily make me faster maybe a little bit the main thing is that you just feel a bit more smooth and if you're like let's say your car starts sliding you can correct it a lot quicker um so it's just things like that you just could more consistent more smooth it does feel more enjoyable to me but i'm someone who likes a lot of feedback in the wheel so but there we go top 10 i'll take that um in the peugeot only person in the peugeot in the top 10 but I know I can go quicker. I, I know I can do a 0.8. But it's just like hooking up the lap is very difficult. 
Um, right, let's jump back in. Look at that. Lockdown number three, eh? Is it actually tier five? Have they have they actually changed it? Let me have a look. BBC News. What have they done? Soon there'll be like helicopters circling outside your house. As soon as you go outside your window, like you get a red dot on your on your head. And the army tell you to go back inside. UK must move to COVID alert level five. Is that the same as tier five? Or is that something different? Who knows? Who the F knows? Tier freaking five. Oh yeah, a uh, Felix. Feliciano, no one has ever done a better ending than you did in the last video. No one has ever, no one has ever done that. She would be proud. Um, I'll just say, guys, if you haven't watched my last video, you've got to give it a watch. But make sure you stay through to the end because you're in for an absolute banger, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, man. Right, let's just try and go a little bit quicker. Um, so I'm using the Peugeot here. And in the race, you want to put the tyre uh, brake bias towards the front a little bit because the rear tyres wear out quite a lot in this car. Thank you, Samuel Freeman. Yes, mate. Uh, race A and B are uh, SR suicide by the looks of it. When I was editing that video, I was just, I was cracking up at like two in the morning. <laughs> I was like, I, I cannot wait till the viewers see this. What account am I on? I am on Scott Speed, so I'm in the Americas at the moment. Cut the lawn. Area. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Such a good meme. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Come on, 28.9. Not quite. I think I'm breaking a little bit too early. You can break like frighteningly close to the 50 board in this car. And if there's one thing you need to get right in sim racing, it's your breaking point, honestly. You get that right, but the rest of the corner just just flows. So yeah close to that 50 board. Hmm. Still didn't, didn't get the line right.
50 Dom. The fiver. <laughs> well, I'll give you my phone number so she can uh, message me, mate. Sorry, but you know, that's just the super GT effect. I can only apologise, my friend. Turn! Whoop. There we go. Look at that, just gained a tenth. Suck it, ghost. Won't better finish this lap though. That's annoying. Oh mate, look at this. I'm one and a half tenths up on a 29-0. This could be a point eight. Messed it up. Oh, okay. Well, I, de I definitely can do a, like a 28, uh, 29 8. But. Okay. Not bad. Pole position. God, what? where's the competition? Am I in a low rated lobby here? Let me, let me have a look at my ratings quick. Scott Speed. What's my SR? 80. Oh, God. Okay. Maybe I should have started at the back then. Whoops. Um, oh, my, so my driver rating it is S. I'm oh, sorry, my sportsmanship rating, but it's only 80 out of 99. It needs to be above 90. Hmm. What should I do here then? Yeah, it's mid-afternoon, but I'm definitely in a low lobby. Um, I... Let's go on to the mediums first. And then, and then change over. So for those who have just joined, you have to use... You can see at the bottom right, uh, you have to use the medium and, and the soft in the race so you, you have to do a pit stop you lose about eight seconds on the pit stop it's actually not too bad you don't want to do two pit stops you only want to do one but yeah i need to um i need to get my driver rating up so i just need to have a clean race <laughs> beware of p10 it's called rama 1964 okay Thank you, Hassan. Happy New Year's. Thank you very much, man. Hashtag stay blessed. This is going to be a very hashtag blessed year, I hope. Just with the news that we're going to go into another lockdown. Love it. Love it. Although it doesn't really change anything for me, so no news as far as I'm concerned. Righty then, race number one of the live stream. Uh, so, brake bias, I'm going to put it slightly towards the front. This car, the rear tyres wear out quite quickly, so you counter that by putting your bias to the walls, uh, towards the front. Fuel, you don't have to worry about. That's not going to run out at all. Um, so, I'm starting on the medium, which will be a bit slow. If the guy behind is on softs, he might catch up, but we'll see. And I'm using the Peugeot, for anyone wondering. So obviously you want to drive quickly, but you don't want to be too sort of forceful in your tyres. Thank you, Pyro Duck. <laughs> no worries, mate. ASMR Super GT. I should go on the car map, shouldn't I? Do some bedtime stories on that. I'm going to make a surprise appearance on all the ASMR channels. I 
I should have got my rating up before before I came on this stream, but sometimes it's good to have a clear race on your own where you can um, just practice, sort of. So right now there's no one challenging me, so I can sort of just, I don't have to worry about that. I can just focus on driving cleanly, looking at my braking po uh, points, because the braking points will change because of the tyre wear. So you can't quite break near the 50 as you would in the time trial. But daily race is probably the best race to get your SR up. Because it is a longer race, there's more sectors. <laughs> yeah, man. Well, there's nothing I can do at the moment. It's my SR rather than my DR. So I want to do about um, six laps. As I said earlier, you lose about eight seconds in the pit lane, about that. So I'm 4.2 ahead at the moment. So if I were to pit now, I would come out in that massive group for seconds. So that would be a stupid thing to do. I can see the back flipping, yeah. Fortunately enough, the interlagos straight is quite long, so you can you can do you probably fit in a couple of ninja rolls and backflips, you know. Day one Hope everyone is well in 2021. Hope the year is treating you well so far. We're still alive. That's how you're watching. If you wasn't alive, then you wouldn't be able to watch this stream. And I know that, that's a fact. I don't think I've ever had someone who's dead watch my stream before. Thank you, biggest two stopper for the lols. We'll try and do it. I'll try and do it, mate. If I can get another eight seconds on everyone. Dead inside. Yeah, there is that, I'm afraid. You might be dead inside. I wouldn't know. I wonder where Rama 1964 is. Oh, RIP in peace, Devon. Rest in peace in peace, mate. Sorry to hear that. Thanks for the dono, though, lol. <laughs> P in peace. 
by how far we had, seven seconds. Yeah, with uh, Albon in TTM, I think, yeah, he should be doing most of the rounds. I think he said, like, whenever there's not, like, a, a clash with his other duties, but I don't think there'll be much of that. It'd be interesting to see how he does. Because um, DTM is going to be different, I think, isn't it? Going to, it's going to GT cars rather than like those Super GT looking cars. Hey, thank you, Andreas. Appreciate it, mate. <laughs> he wants to see a backflip. Man just wants to see a backflip. Very solid choice, this um, Peugeot. It's just very easy to manage. Doesn't feel like there's much drama with it. Doesn't really slide about much. Thank you, Thomas Pierce. <laughs> Thomas Pierce. Thank you very much, bro. Well, we'll do one more lap and then we'll come in. And we'll be able to measure, hopefully, exactly how much time we lose in the pit lane. 31.7, so you see the consistency there in the lap times. 31.5, 31.5, 31.6, And you see there, the tyres just beginning to cause a bit of trouble. But consistency, decent. It's normally about this sort of lap where you begin to go off a cliff with your lap times. Two tenths off in the first sector. Michael Rue, good to see you, mate. Good to see you. Jesse D as well, yep. Scott Speed is back. I need to make a Scott Jag account. Scott Jag is the best Scott in the world. Coming in. Thank you, Ra Ranger from Tonga. Or Ranger. I, I, I probably said it wrong. I always say everything wrong. Right, gap is 10.3, 10.4 as we come in. And I'm going to the soft tyre. Do not refuel. <laughs> right, here we go. So I am going to, yep, still be in the lead. Let's see what the gap is. It was 10.4. 2.8. What's it going to settle down to? 2.8, 2.6, 2.7, 2.8. Let's say about 2.8. Um, so how much time do I lose? About eight seconds ish. Yeah, you lose about eight seconds. Oh, yeah, just under eight seconds, like seven point something. And now I'm on the soft tyre. If I can build up another 8 seconds, I'll go into the pit lane again. Well, let's just do it anyway. I'll go in at the end of... Wait, 7, 8, 9... I'll go in at the end of 9. Oh, he's going to pit now.
Is my uh, is the rig direct drive? It is indeed. It is indeed. It's the Fanatec DD1 for PS4. Here's what I'm using here. Put inters on. Wait. If I if I build up a bit more of a gap. Actually, I don't want to risk my SR. I just want to get my SR up. Something could easily happen. Blue flag! Am I using a capture card? Yes, I use the Elgato 4K60. For game capture. Yeah, I'm not going to use 100% force feedback. That's a killer, mate. 30.5 there. Are you fog? All the best for 2021. That's very kind of you. Thank you very much, man. Have a great year, bro. And everyone, let's all have a great year. As good as it can be, anyway. Why do you not use a PC? I don't know what you mean. I am using a PC to stream. I'm not using a PC to play this game because it isn't on PC. So I'm not, I'm not understanding that question really. It does amaze me the amount of people who don't know that Gran Turismo is only on PlayStation. If I go in on lap 12 and put on inters, let's see if we can do it. I wonder how bad inters actually are. <laughs> Last lap in reverse. How do I have a good connection to the US servers? I don't really know. I mean, well, I mean, you know, I've got hyper optic internet. But to be honest, I, for the most part, I seem to have a better connection than most of the Americans. I don't really know how that works. So I'm seeing a lot of yellow three bar connections whenever I'm in this server. Um, I don't really get that too much when I'm in the European server. So I don't know what that's all about. Yeah, I don't know what the yeah I don't know what, I always thought that America the United States has really good internet but I don't know maybe maybe the country's sort of because it's so big that doesn't help maybe I don't really know because like maybe it's easier in terms of in infrastructure to have a smaller country you can let more people can have access to better internet if the court if the because each country in Europe is a lot smaller obviously that maybe it's easy like that I don't really know you, 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 you'd assume that America would have that everyone would have a really good connection but I don't know maybe not depends where you live yeah I suppose if you're in, a, if you're in New York or LA it's going to be good probably but obviously not everyone is in LA or New York there's lots of remote places 
depends where you live. It's the same in the same in every country, really, isn't it? If you live in London, it's probably going to be alright. But a lot of villages. If you're in some remote village somewhere, then probably won't be anywhere near as good. Right, one more lap and then I'll pit in for Inters. I mean, I'm 18 seconds ahead. If I lose 8 seconds of the pit in, in the pit lane, then I've got 10 seconds to play with. And that might sound like a lot, but you could easily lose 10 seconds in one lap because of Inters. I don't really know. We'll see. Thank you, Lewis. What was my previous job? I was an auditor for a clothing brand in like a warehouse. Nothing amazing. Didn't pay particularly well. Was boring. Was dead end. <laughs> so, I'd much prefer doing YouTube, if I'm honest. Yeah, I don't miss my old job. I really don't. Thank you, Jables. Right. Let's go. The two-stop strategy for the lols. Da-da-da-da-da. Right, here we go. Wait, are Inters an option? Oh, they're not even an option. You can't choose them. Okay. Pointless pit stop then. Thank you, Simon. Is that one of those joke names? Just trying to think. With De Cock at the end. I do apologise. Love the content. Mate, Simon, I love to hear that. Thank you very much. I'm, I'm glad you like it. I'm glad you enjoy it. Thank you, Gravy, as well. Yeah, cheers, Simon. Um, that's the number one thing, you know, with YouTube, just people enjoying the videos. And I really enjoyed the comments on the on the last video that I made. Um, I think a lot of people really enjoyed that. <laughs> that. Uh, that, that race ending it's a Dutch name yeah I do apologise you never know these days on the internet but yeah cheers Simon um, what was I saying um, yeah I would say that like, the most rewarding thing about this job is like just you know people tuning in and saying they enjoyed it enjoyed the video or they had a laugh because of it that's always the good bit, you know? So, I'm always happy to hear that. Okay, hopefully that's good enough for our SR. Oh, right. Just over 20 minutes. Did I see... Wait. Where is he? Someone's saying Marmaduke's here. Tiamat Mard UK. Where is he? Tiamat Mard UK. Where are you? I'll find your name. Make yourself known, Tiamat Mard UK. Uh, but yeah, there we go. Race number one. Um... I don't think you want to do many more laps than six or seven. You either want to pit on lap six or lap seven. And that, that's the same depending on if you're medium or soft at the start. 
But there you go. Hopefully my SR is alright now. We could do race A quickly. Oh, that's going to kill my SR again, isn't it? And I can jump over to my European account, I suppose. Okay, alright. 98. We're going to take a risk and do race A. I'm just going to start at the back and just... I won't really be forceful. I'll just try to pick my way through the trouble and see if it's possible to do the race without getting SR down. Which it isn't, but let's let's try it. Okay. Um, wait, do I have a free choice? Honestly, Specially provided car. What do you want to use here then? What are people using the Peugeot? Yeah. It's a Peugeot Peugeot week this week. Thank you, Steve Alvarez Brown Momos. Have a seven million year penalty. Well, imagine having to wait for seven million years. You have a child and then they have to wait. When you die, they have to wait and then they have to have a child for seven million years. Now that's a penalty. Thank you, Soren. Keep behaving that way. Uh, you will be sent to the shadow realm. And thank you, Ricci. Thank you very much, Ricci. Thank you, Soren, as well. Hope you get hope you get sent well into 2021. Excited to see what you come up with over the next year. And thank you for the work you do. Soren, thank you very much, mate. I do appreciate that. You absolute legend. And Richie as well. And Steve Alvarez Brown Momos. Interestingly. Right, this is the stupid track with the stupid chicane. Can you send Boris to the Shadow Realm? I wish I could send COVID to the Shadow Realm. That would be more useful, wouldn't it? Imagine how. Imagine if I had the power just to go, right, it's over, COVID's done, and it ended. Imagine how popular I'd be. Everyone would love me if you just went, right, click my fingers, and it's, it's gone. Zero cases. No one's going to die anymore. It doesn't exist. You'd be the most popular person on the planet. Like you sim racing degenerate. Um, will I ever do an iRacing Enduro with some bloke called Chippy Broadbent? Well... I think it's about time we did, you know? Uh, I wouldn't rule it out, let's put it that way. Hello, Cash Racer, Good. Uh, how are you doing? Adventure Racing, how are you doing, good sir? Well, I'm not gonna set a lap. We're starting at the back. Well, let's just do a bit of practice. Alrighty then. I need the COVID gauntlet from Thanos. Get rid of get rid of COVID forever. Thank you, Adrian again. <laughs> Don't let Barry R catch up. There's a very good chance of that happening, I'm afraid. Breaking just before the 100 board. Oh, beautiful. B E A beautiful. Um, yeah, the hairpin is a big SR down zone. That's where everyone's SR gets sent into the Shadow Realm. And then, of course, we have the chicane of random chance, which is just stupidly annoying. And that is coming up for anyone who wondering who is wondering what the hell that even is. Imagine this track on Forza 7. God. Oh, God. Right, here we go. Let's see this stupid thing. I, I hate this chicane. It's so stupid. Who, who, who designed this? Oh. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Okay. You can take that final corner flat if you get it dead right. Alrighty then. Race number two. Let's just test this race. Um, any race around this track is often asking for trouble because of those two flashpoints, the hairpin and the chicane. 
and the fact there's walls on every corner. Barry R is very prominent around here. He likes to, he likes the company. I don't think it's such a bad track. Um, I prefer the, the one that I like the most is the one where you drive down towards that dock area and you've got that really long sort of four apex right hander. Um, it's one of the expressway, I don't know, East Loop, oh, West, I can't remember the name of it. All the names are confusing. East Outer Loop, I can't remember. But that's probably my best, or my favourite Tokyo. <laughs> Barry Hart designed it. East Outer Loop. Okay, starting ninth. Let the games begin. Rama1964, he's followed me. <laughs> Hello, Rama1964. Honestly, what are we doing? Racing or pick rock? Can you do another 100 four speed back race so I have an excuse to edit? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I saw your video. I can't give you any more content, just Tong. Oh, someone sent three super chats. I do apologize. Bebus Salad. Let's have a look. Well, I say thank you, Bebus Salad. Yeah, it hasn't popped up for some reason. But thank you, you absolute legend. One of the best legends in the world. Okay. What are we predicting here, everyone? Starting ninth. It's almost like I'd rather start twelfth than ninth. Because at the back you can just sort of I don't know. I've noticed this in real karting as well. Sometimes Sometimes they give you like two heats. Uh so yeah, you do two races and they give you um, they average out your start, so you might start first and last, or you might start second and second to last, or you might start like in the middle and in the middle, so your average is even. But sometimes it's better to start like it's it's better to have the first than the last than it is to have two middles, because in the middle you're very likely to just get involved in carnage twice. Whereas with the the first and the last, the first you can just get away, with the last you can just side through the carnage which is easy to do from the back because you can see it developing in front of you a bit easier but we'll see that's just my humble opinion ultimately just get on with it deal with it do I need TCS in this car? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Okay, let's keep it nice and clean, everyone. Thank you. Thanks for that. Very cool. Right, this is the first pinch point. I'm going narrow. Oh, what are you doing coming back that way? Don't give me a penalty for that. You're just waiting for the penalty to pop up. I'm in sixth. You're just waiting for that penalty. Oh, the guy in the lead's got a one bar connection. Love it. Absolutely love it. Right, here we go then. Chicane of stupidity. 
Oh, should I go for a move? This is very risky, but I'm on the inside, so you best back out there, boy. Right, okay. Yep, forced another car off the track. I'm not sure exactly what car I forced off, but okay. <laughs> yep, great. Absolutely fantastic. Three seconds as well, like. Is this some sort of sick joke? Yes, yes it is. This is gonna kill me, this. Oh my God. Well, we're going to have to save that replay and see which person I horrifically <laughs> shoved off the road. That is the worst place for that. <laughs> you lose so much time there. This is a sick joke. Right, let's just try and get sixth, I guess. Well, you never know what's going to happen here because people could easily get penalties and... So let's spend lap three just trying to catch back up again. And then just hope for the best. Oh yeah. Has there been an incident? Four second penalty for this guy. Love it. Four seconds. Hope you like 12th place, mate. Because that's where you're going to be in a minute. See ya. Right. Back into sixth. Podium is possible, I think. Third is, third is right there. So let's see how this one develops. Oh, he's gone for the move. I'll take that then. Thank you. Oh my. What is going? What are they doing? This car, this VW just went into the first corner like two miles an hour. Oh, penalty. He's got no straight line speed. What's up with him? Oh, mate. Good night. Good night, sweet prince. This is quite a fun race, but it's just a risky race for SR. Oh, oh, what are they doing? At least we got back to third after that horrific penalty. Got the fastest lap as well. Do, 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 do. PX Cam, good to see you, bro. 
If I had maybe two more laps, might have been able to catch up with the lead, but well, we don't have two more laps, do we? So, well, we slow through there. Oh, bro. Drag race to the line. Oh. Well, at least he didn't force me into the wall. That's, I was half expecting that. <laughs> What's Daily Race C this week? It is Interlagos Group 3, 13 laps. Have to use soft and medium. There we go. Third. There's a good little battle at the end there. Up six positions. Now we must analyse how I murdered that guy. Which was just absolutely horrific, and I should be I should be tried for crimes against humanity. It was that bad. My SR's gone down. Love it. Goodbye. Oh, mate. Right, now what's my SR gone down to on this account? 91. Okay, I'm still in the top class. It's all right. Just about. Let's have a look at that replay. Let's see these crimes against humanity. Absolute murder. Do, 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 do. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? Thank you, Crash Area. I saw your name in there, mate. Started behind me. Where did you finish, man? Um, I didn't have a look at the results. Oh, I can find out now. Righty then. Right, let's witness the horror. The horror is inflicted by Super GT on this fateful day. That, that was it. Okay, right, let's watch this. No, it's this guy. So I'm up, that's me on the right. Sorry, that is 100% his fault. He got a penalty for that. So by this point, I've got to run. By this point, you got a question like, surely he knows I'm there. But, like, why are you turning in? There's a car there. Well, well, well. <laughs> Rip. There you go. I am I am the new Momos, as it turns out. Scott Speed is is the United States Momos. Absolute filth. I should be locked up, and the key should be thrown away. Oh well. I was just I was wondering what happened uh, after that penalty because I caught up this was really weird because this guy's like this guy's going it's like he wasn't using full power oh, have a look at his throttle on the exit here it hits the wall He's using full power, he's just going really slow. <laughs> Still all over the place. Oi, just into that gap. I think it kicked off here between these guys. Here's the wall. We got a penalty for that. 
Oh, ruthless. Oh, you, you got half a second. Nice crash error. Ready to crash error finish. Six, seven. All done, crash error. Oh, there we go, Bieber salad. When you got your first sim rig? Um, probably about three years ago, maybe. I had like a Will Stand Pro with the Frostmaster TX back on the Xbox. Actually, no, this was like maybe four years ago, four or five years ago now. So quite a while. Um, I think we just do one in the USA. Let's do one in in Europe. Should I wait for race B? Let's do race B in Europe. Yeah, FF understeer, mate. Don't you just love it? See you later, Scott. Where's my water? How many hours a week do you play? Um, to be honest, it's just like for when I make the videos, like the FIAs I normally do, so that I might be, I might do two of those, like two, how would you call it, what's the word, entries, so like I'll do one race and then I'll do another one, so that might take two, three hours, and then daily races, like today, like before this stream, I played maybe an hour and a half, setting lap times, doing the doing daily race C once. So I did it twice, set lap times in all of them. But I don't, it's not like I sit here for hours on end every day playing it. I only play it just to do the videos, really. Um, so I suppose... Which one should I do? I suppose we've got to do race B. Give it a go. Yeah, let's tr let's try and improve our lap time on this. Let's uh, let's watch the top time. Cadge racer. Let's see what. Let's see how he's doing it. Is there a wheel I recommend for someone who plays with one hand left? I've never had that question before. Um, I don't really know, mate. I'm, I don't really know of a specific wheel that would help you because you're using one hand. Um, I don't really know what to say, to be honest. But it's good to hear that you've been inspired. So people using the Veyron for this today, uh, Daily Race B, and you notice you have to upshift very early, or about two thirds. See the breaking point. So you see there's like a change of tarmac. Um, so here into turn one that you have the 150 board. Just before that you have a line and then you have another line. So, just before that change of tarmac, I guess. So you're braking. And that's down into first gear. Yep. So, <laughs> that is bang on the limit. As long as you've got two wheels on this red, white and green, then you're okay. And he's... I mean, that is on the edge, but... That's what you gotta do. And then this one. First gear. And you get on the power really early. Because it's a group four car, but it's a very heavy group four car, so it's very planted on the power. Let's see where he breaks. There should be a little pathway on the right after the 150 boards. There. Third gear, second gear. Okay. Let's 
post through there, fourth gear, very tidy, third gear, Pyology, thank you very much, yes mate, I am very excited, I'm excited to see how DTM goes next year to be honest, or this year, I keep saying it's next year, it's this year. Gear, fourth gear. Yeah. Just a very, very tidy lap. You always notice that about the top guys. They're just so smooth. Okay. Eight minutes to go. I'm seventh. I can improve that though. I know I can improve that time. But I would like to improve my livery first. And uh, what am I doing? Try, uh, changing the livery on the Veyron. The Veyron, I've got the crunch livery. Liveries are worth half a tenth, no doubt about that. What have we got? Hmm. Blank pan. They're a bit boring, to be fair, aren't they? Let's go for this red one. Red is the quickest colour. We all know that. Yeah, 10 miles an hour on the straight. Liveries, that's what they do. Okay, let's jump in. And... What am I doing? Race entry. Veyron. Let's go. Bloody Veyron, man. What? I'm, I'm going to get the question in a minute. Why is, why is the Audi TT keeping up with the Bugatti Veyron? This is really unrealistic. This game's rubbish. That's because it's... A, that's because all the cars are tuned to be balanced. You're an idiot for playing this. Why those cars, they're not the, the... Nothing should keep up with a Veyron. Even on the last video, it's like, how comes a Supra is going... How comes a stock Supra is going 260? It's like, well, it's not a stock Supra. That is why. Righty then, let's go. We have seven and a half minutes to try and improve on a 56.2. Okay, let's go. Look at it. Here's a big boy. Look at that mirror. What's that all about? Oh, didn't use first gear. Should have been in first gear then. Do I think they'll add the shear on? Not to this game. I don't think they're going to add many cars to this game now, but maybe in GT7. Taking that a lot quicker. And that one as well. Yeah, customise, mate. I'm driving the quickest car in the world. Everyone knows that this is the fastest car in the world, so there's no chance I'm going to lose now. This is guaranteed victory. It's basically like cheating. 
using this car is basically cheating. Okay, I need to be able to power a lot earlier. Seven. That's not a good lap. That is nicked good. Come on. Oh, still slower. What a noob. first chicane anyway yeah why am I using miles an hour we use miles an hour in the UK yes we're stuck in 1980s we're stuck in the 1950s this is the weird thing about the UK we we sort of we use lots of different like if you ask for someone's weight Half of people would give you kilograms and half of people would give you stone and pounds. Like, we, we have this weird mix. Baby, come on. Just pat a bada 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 left to get right now. And that was pretty darn average. It's an improvement. 56-0. We'll have enough time for one lap, maybe. See if we can improve. That's a negative. Carried way too much speed in. We didn't trail break it enough on the way in. 56 0. I can definitely improve that.
that could be a 55-7 or an 8, I reckon. If I nailed it. Okay. Moves me up a little bit. What's the number one? 55-2. So I'm within a second of that. 8 tenths off. Okay. Yeah, I can definitely go quicker than that. Right, 20 seconds until the race. Yeah, short shifting in that car. You want to short shift um, maybe two thirds up the rev gauge. About that. It's just where the power is. Um, often in cars which have seven gears, you short shift a little bit. It tends to be the way. <laughs> Thank you, Matthew Churchard. Churchard? Churchard. I'll say both to cover both possibilities. Um, but yes, I agree, mate. How can I see my rating in GT? Go to kudosprime.com. Wi-Fi password is here. You want Wi-Fi? Um, you want Wi-Fi? You want um, Kudos Prime? And then go to the play go to Grand Turismo 4, go to the players tab, type in your PSN ID, and then all your details will come up. Righty then. Let's have a look here then. What have we got? What have we got? Ladies and gentlemen. Right, get your predictions in for this race. How is it gonna go? How many deaths are there gonna be? Probably how many people in the race 16 i'm guessing 16 deaths minimum some people might even die twice it's that bad i don't know where i'm breaking in the slipstream that could be a problem monza t monza turn one is the it's probably one of the most famous Shadow Realm portals in the known universe, other than Death Chicane at Dragon Trial. What other big portals are there? Nurburgring Turn 1, you could say. There's quite a lot out there. There's quite a few big portals. <laughs> I'm I'm just gonna leave this F in the chat in advance. Just type F now because it's gonna happen at some point. Right, let's go. Bring it on! Bugatti. I'm driving my Bugatti. How is that Peugeot keeping up with the Bugatti? With the, with the Bugatti. <laughs> preemptive Fs. Don't you love a preemptive F? Still don't know where I'm braking. Let's just go with the usual spot. Probably too early on lap one, but. Okay. No Fs here. Oh, where's he going?
Oh, penalty. This game's so unrealistic. Why isn't that Bugatti going 260? Why is that Peugeot keeping up with the Veyron? Why is the Supra going... Oh, that's a penalty. Why is that Supra going 260 on your video? Oh, God. Well, I might as well go for the pass then. Well, all your Fs worked, didn't they? Because I've got the penalty now. Where's the penalty zone? I'm going to still defend, bro. He's trying it around the outside. Got the measure of him. Where? Oh, yes, yeah, on the back straight, isn't it? Towards Ascari. It's only half a second, though, so... Oh! I should have defended that. He's not really gone for it. Okay, here it is. Oh, lose the toe. And now I'm going to be. Nah, this guy's going to get my toe. That is deeply frustrating. Oh, did he just get a penalty there? Let's have a look. No, it was very close though. Very close indeed. Right, two laps. I oh, know this guy. This guy's in my toe now. in the Bulgari. Right, I'm 1.2 behind. If I can get that down to below a second on this lap, then I might have a faint whiff of a chance. But he's pulling away, actually. Really gaining. Gap 1.3. Okay, to that rubbish.
use my missiles. Possible penalty, yeah. Also. Took a chance through there, I had to take it perfect, and I just cut it a bit too much. Probably won't be doing this race again. It's a bit boring. Or I'm just rubbish at it. There's that as well. RIP in pieces, everybody. Yeah, Monza's a bit like, eh, in Group 4 cars. Group 3 cars is, yeah, Group 3 is where it's at. Do you make any of your own liveries? No. Ain't nobody got time for that. Four. Let's hope my SI didn't go too far down after those penalties, but should be alright. Should be okay. Uh, oh no, my SI went up. Okay. Fair enough. Na, 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 na. Okay, we have a bit of time before race C, so I might as well try and improve my lap time. I know I can. Let me um go and get another down, bottle of water. The wheel, and if you want to win, go a little bit faster than all the others. Thank you, Cass. Ha! Well, I wouldn't know, mate. I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know, bro. Um, let's go with the Peugeot. Yeah, I feel comfortable in the Peugeot. It's a very Peugeot day today. Thank you, Cass, though, for the donation. You're my new hero. Okay, um, let me go get a new bottle of water. Let this race load. And then I'll be back. Alrighty, alrighty. Alrighty. Oh. over it? Yeah, I was having a shit. <laughs> thank you, Yer did. And thank you, yeah. Have you ever created a racetrack on GJ5? I can't say I have, mate. I can't say that I have. Stay 
Not like bucket slash bouquet. Wait, I don't get that. Bucket slash bouquet. What's that got to do with church? Church chard. Chard. Am I, I'm completely lost. I don't really get that. Church chard. Church chard. Anyway. But thank you. Um, let's just try and improve our time, I guess. I know I can do a point eight. Possibly a point seven. Let's let's give it a go. Oh, is there some TV show it's related to? Okay, I don't I don't really know that one. Da, 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 da. Right, we've got um, someone remind me. In 14 minutes that we've got to go into the race. So maybe in 12 minutes time. If I don't miss it. losing Arsenal are going to win the title you heard it here first they just they just let everyone get ahead just to make a sensational comeback you watch thank you Kaldowski for the 20 quid that's very nice of you mate have some cheers mum you absolute baller. Right. Come on in. Up the mighty Southampton. Legends. Kev Kevin Eldon. Big train. Okay, I'll remember that for later. The one, I mean, in real life, people don't really say Alex Albon. I suppose most people don't really know who he is. Just general people in the street. Um, people have said I look like um, Dante Basco. Is it Dante Basco? Or Taylor Lautner. Thank you, Brad and Nita. The first 2021 reminder. Thank you, Tyranator. I probably said that wrong, didn't I? The thousand Hungarian forints. Probably a penalty. No, okay.
Oh man! I had a tenth and a half on that lap. That could have been a mid point eight. Um, hello Super GT, keep it up, uh, keep up the good work. Really like your streaming the races. Are you waiting for the new GT game? Your fan from Hungary? Yes, I am, mate. I'm. I can't wait for GT Seven. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, man. Group three into Lagos. What's new there? Um, yeah, we've had this combo. Well, we haven't had this specific combo with the tyre compounds, but... but yeah, I know what you mean, mate. Come on! Turned in too late. Oh, too early, I mean. Ah, I'm, I'm I'm close to getting this point A. But it's just like hooking it all up in one go. I'm having great difficulty with it. Thank you, D. Oh, mate. I could easily go 10th quicker than that lap time. Yeah, I'm even here. So close there. Yeah. I know I can do it. It's just I'm doing one one sector correct and then getting the rest wrong. But yeah, let me. I think I messed that up. Let's get in the race. Look at that, 28.8 optimum if I hooked my best sectors in one. So I lost a quarter of a second on my... I lost a quarter of a second on that fourth lap. God damn. Very frustrating, but I know I can get there. We can get there, guys. Don't you worry. Yeah, it's in the middle set. Well, on my best lap just then, I didn't take. Turn 12 was the final corner. I didn't get 11 right, and I didn't get 10 right, and I didn't get 9 right. <laughs> Thank you, Das Oleg. There is a race to win. Don't you know it, good sir? Come 
Come on. Hello, Dibbler. Good to see you, mate. Good to see you. Liverpool lost. Oh my god, what's going on? Imagine if Man United won the league. <laughs> This is appalling. Uh, no, yeah, Gran Turismo is only on PlayStation. For those wondering, you cannot get it on PC. Thank you, Jack Fleming. Not kill. God, man, that would be awesome. It would also be very chaotic. Oh, I keep getting that too wide. I'm just pushing a little bit too hard there. Breaking a little bit too late, that's what I'm doing. Um, yeah, I think we spoke about this on the last live stream. Um, you know, I'd, I'd like to see some of the classics return. We'll obviously know Trial Mountain's coming back. Like Grand Valley. Deep Forest. Um, but also tracks like Road America, Road Atlanta, Watkins Glen, Sebring. Some of these American tracks would be great to see. Seattle for the memes as well. That'd be awesome online. good but that could easily be a 29-2 but it could also be a 28-8 I don't know ah oh, it's one millisecond off my PB Quite, mate, the white wolf, but thank you. Best it up. Um, twenty eight nine six eight. One million, one thousandth off. Oh well. I think I have a feeling I'll be starting like ninth or something here. 
even possibly lower so the strategy might be to use mediums we shall have a look have a look what is the grid like I'm expecting a, a competitive grid 13th on the grid <laughs> that just shows you that just shows you so even if I did get even if I did Honestly, did get a point eight, what the f are we doing here? I'd still be like seventh on the grid at best. We've got the big boys out tonight. Thank you, South Oz GT seventy nine, Zolder. Yeah, that'd be a good one. Thirteenth on the grid with that lap time. God. Yeah, I think when when you're starting at the front, you want soft at the start, but if you're not. If you're not near the front, you need you, you probably want mediums. Because otherwise you waste your softs. If if the people in front of me have soft tires and I go sorry, if they have mediums and I've got softs <laughs> then I wear out my soft tires trying to pass all them on the mediums. So I think it's best to go medium. Thank you, customize. Yeah, luckily I'm in the race now. Thank you, I feed nut. <laughs> London is white. Oh no, you can sound clip me now. Right, someone banned this guy. <laughs> London's red, mate. We've had three wins in a row. We're still we're gonna win the league. You watch. <laughs> you watch it happen. Right, let's go medium. I mean, this is. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? This is why I love this game sometimes because you can log on, put in a banger of a lap, and you're 12. <laughs> you're 12 on the grid. Williams B racer. He he's the second best player in the world. He finished second at the World Tour 2020. Second. He's the second best player in the world technically, and he's in here. Uh, thank you, Phil. Thank you, Melly. Mahili, one, two, three, four. Love the humor, keep it up. And hello again. How's the M2? M2's great, mate. M2 is going very well. It hasn't broken down on me just yet. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Yeah, Zeria, it's weird, isn't it? I was tenth I was tenth. My lap time was tenth best in the Americas. Which was a slower lap time than this. And then here, I'm twelfth on the grid. You love to see it, but you bing bang actually no well all you Spurs fans can keep donating thanks for the money <laughs> thank you Brian right let's get into this race then Is this a... <sighs> Jesus Christ. What is the point? What is the fucking point? If any he pushed me wide. I didn't push him. How can the car out on the outside be at fault for that? It's fucking stupid. Christ. Oh 
might as well just push this guy because I'm... We're going to serve a penalty. Mate, you might as well just take the line. I'm going to serve a penalty here. Yeah. Um, crap penalties, that would be a good feature to get rid of. Thank you, Andrew. Right, should we stop fighting each other now and move forward? See that people using a wide range of cars for this race. It's not like one or two cars. I'm not going to fight this guy. He's really quick, so I just let him go. You'll probably get get me a lot closer to the guys in front.
Oh man, so much understeer. Oh, he's gone in early. Okay. I want to do one more, I think, then I'll come in. Bono, my grip has gone. AWS graphics, 0% on the front left. And the front right, for that matter. Let's go onto those soft tyres. Everyone's like very evenly paced. Okay, thank you for those, those uh, donations I have uh, no doubt missed. Alright, come on. It's going to be really hard to gain lots of positions here because everyone is very evenly matched. There's Alex. That's the benefit of the undercut for you. Well, you will have worse tyres from now to the end compared to everyone else. Gonna have to work on my qualifying for this one. Try and get that point eight at least or point seven maybe. Rubbish. Even this man behind me is really quick, but he's not gaining on me. So it's like everyone's very, everyone's very quick on this race. The standard is high.
I'm in the tow now. Thank you, Thomas. Well, if I can cheer you up in any way, that's my pleasure, mate. Oh, you liked a bit then. This is a good battle here. I mean, this is the, this is crazy. Like, we're battling for like what tenth? The pace is ridiculous. Everyone's so quick. King. We might best catch up to some of the medium runners if they're slow. We've still got three more laps. Oh, this is exhausting. This is this is a really good fight. You can't rest for one second here. They raced me so hard. Okay. Don't know what these guys are playing at. on different tyres or something. to go. Where did I, I started 12th, I think. That stupid two-second penalty, which really cost me. That, that cost me big time. We are gaining on those guys up there with the medium tyres but it's not going to be enough
Thank you very much for the donation. 20 sacks, quite a lot. I can't believe that dumb penalty. How stupid was that? <laughs> One second penalty. Okay, we need to get within a second of this guy then. He's gained three tenths. Probably yes, the slipstream of the guy ahead, which is going to help him. We are gaining on that group, but it's not going to be enough. Just that two second penalty really messed me up. Really messed me up. I'll be up in that group, I think, without that. Man, it wasn't enough, but got back to where we started. I just can't believe that penalty. How dumb was that? Oh, B racer one in the in the alpha. Yeah, did what I could. Did what I could. What's the best place to overtake? Probably uh, turn one, if not turn four. Turn one and four, probably the best two places, I'd say. Yeah, let's have a look at the replay, I suppose. But I want to do this race again. I'm just trying to think which car to do it in. A couple of V12 Vantages up there. Callum was in the top five in the Peugeot. V12 Vantage, eh? Uh, Super WRX. Mm. All right. Yeah, that penalty. I mean, what a joke. Yeah, I was having a shit. <laughs> Wimbledon Blue. Love it. Let's have a look quickly. Thank you to Santos. Thank you, Dogs. Thank you, King of Onyx. Thank you, Thomas Perales. There's a couple of people as well I missed, but... But thank you very much, guys. I was concentrating hard on that race. Uh, I, had, I had to be really focused for the whole 13 minutes. Okay. Oh, mate, come on. Hurry up, replay. Oh, you have to watch this stupid thing at the start. No one cares. Why are they? <laughs> right, here we go. The most savage, sickening penalty I've ever seen.
what an absolute joke. Hey, thank you, Ultra, for becoming a member. Right, let's see. How much time did I lose then? So I went. I lost like. Maybe three seconds plus three positions. That's quite a lot of loss. Thank you, Sinister Plague. Um. Oh, I've only got two minutes to learn a new car. God. Um. Let's tr let's try it. I need a cruel man. <laughs> Get a beetle race. I don't know how good that car is. I don't want to name a price, to be honest. I'll give the Aston a go because I know it's somewhat good. Clearly overtook from the right side. This is not Britain, you cannot do that. Yeah. Yeah. Right, let's give this a quick whirl. The Aston Martin. I'm on the medium tyres, okay. Portimao Estoril. Um, I can't really remember Estoril, if I'm completely honest. I know they used to race it in F1 in the 90s. So for that reason, I'll say Portimao. So it was very drivable actually. Okay, not perfect lap, but for a first lap, not too bad. I don't really have any concerns. Right, okay, 30 points are quite slow actually. Okay, the brakes aren't as good. The Peugeot does have very good brakes. Alright. This should be alright. This could be okay. If you keep behaving that way, uh, you will be sent to the Shadow Realm. Thank you, Mr. Rage Apex. Just got a 204 at Monza. Such a noob. Yeah, man, I mean... If you go back into earlier in the stream, you can watch, um, I watch, or you can just do it on your own game. You could watch the top replay. Just look for the breaking points. Once you get your breaking points right, you should be able to improve quite a lot. And what was the last time I got? One fifty-six. But yeah, just just focus on your breaking points, and that that will help you a lot. Right, what have we got? Mustang at the, at the top. A couple of Peugeots in there. Pick the guy. Yeah, I can't change the livery now. It's too late. Um, we want to go medium, yeah. Start on the mediums. And then go on to the soft halfway through. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Ok, 
Okay. Nope, this isn't going to be much of a warm up. Maybe one corner. Not even that. <laughs> Not even going to do any warm up here. There's your warm up. Those tyres are scorching hot now. Right, okay. I need to get. If I go one tenth quicker, I'm like five positions higher up on the grid. Na 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 na. Okay, burn some fuel. Eleventh on the grid this time. In an unfamiliar vehicle, but. We'll give it a jolly good go. And if we don't get a stupid penalty, that might help. <sighs> right, let's go. Samuel, again. Good mate. Thank you to Santos. Oh, come on guys, let's not fight too much. You don't want to fight at this early stage. Mr. Callan, thank you. Good to see you. I don't know where I'm braking in this car in the slipstream. Oh, big fight back there. I'll let him go. This guy seems a bit... He's a bit wild, this guy. I don't really like racing him. He's all over the place. 
bit erratic. Maybe, oh, he must be on soft tyres. Because he's a lot quicker. He's on soft tyres, for sure. That's probably a good thing, actually. We can just, like, follow him through. Yeah, that move was never going to work. Oh, for fuck's sake! This game! It's fucking stupid now. Fucking done with it. This is fucking stupid, like really fucking stupid. There's no one behind. One second penalty. Just try and keep up with him now and then hopefully get past him. Thank you, Alex. <laughs> yeah, man. Everyone's spamming their F letters today. Ancient pleb guy is fighting way too much on this first stint. He needs to like learn that you need to not you actually don't want to fight on this first stint. He's the reason why we've lost so much ground to 8th and 9th. He just kept defending unnecessarily.
Like in a race like this, when when it's so close, you don't want to defend because you're just you're just killing your own race. This car is it's, uh, very good in a straight line. It's not too good um, in the long corners. Like the handling is a bit lacking. Okay, let's see what happens here at the uh, pit stops. Is everyone else is coming in? Okay, we've got some cars to look. Three and a half seconds ahead. Let's do our best to try and catch them. Okay, yeah, so I've just gained a second on this. So this guy in front is the other Aston Martin user. He, he He's now on medium tyres. And he's fighting with the Supra. We need to learn to work together. These guys are stupid. Are this, can they not see there's someone in front of them on my slower tyres? They can catch them up and they stop fighting. Oh, Jesus Christ.
not even going to slow down for that. What car am I using? Uh, the Aston Martin V12 Vantage. He's realised you have to work together. A little bit too late. laps to go. Oh, they've dropped right back. Where did I start? 11. So I've gained. So I've moved forward on this one. Curve almost got me. What, two seconds ahead? Might be tricky, but we'll give it a good shot. So the leading group really isn't that far away either. I don't know what they're playing at. They're just up the top of that hill. We're only six seconds off the lead. Are they like having some sort of hardcore battle or something? Look at them, like top six is a big group. Oh, wrong game.
Thank you, Devon, again. Cheers, Mum. Oh, some penalties up there. What's going on? Am I seeing a five second penalty? How are we on this leading group? This is mad. <laughs> they must have had a. They must be really fighting each other because we've gained so much. Shame it's not going to be enough because it's lap 13, but... Anyway, look. I went on the internet and I found this. Thank you, Just Tong. God, look at that battle up there. Oh, sick. <laughs> Finished sixth after all that. My god. Sixth from 11th. Four seconds off the lead. That was a slow race. 20 minutes. B Racer did. The last race was 19 minutes 53. He was seven seconds slow in this one. <laughs> we got our sixth place though. Just had to be, just had to be, didn't it? I think the thing about the Aston I noticed in that race is that it's really good at, at the start of the stint. It's really quick, but then it, the tire wear gets it and it doesn't, it really slows down quite a lot at the end of the stint. But, um, that wasn't too bad. I just wonder what was happening. I think maybe someone was just defending at the front. And that's why they were so slow. I think that's probably what it was. And we, oh, we got that stupid penalty as well, like, oh my god, man. Oh, man. It was good fun. It was a good fun race, but... Oh, okay, yeah. I was going to say, like, B-Race, like, that front group, there's something was going on with that front group because they were all, like, really slow. I shouldn't have caught up that much. They were obviously fighting or doing something weird. But there you go. This is a good race, though. I mean, it's a close one. I do need to improve my qualifying, ideally. Um, that was the main problem, I think. I need to be, like... Point eight. Right. I want to go back in the Persia. I want to do this race again. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? I'm gonna go back in the Persia because I feel comfortable in that car. And then, um, hopefully, this race we can we can do it without a stupid penalty. That's the aim. Thank you, since the plague. Send your message on Twitter. Keep up the good racing. Okay, mate. I'll have a look later. Key, okay, mate. The last two races. I've been going around the outside of someone and I've got a penalty for like the contact. Um, it's, it's just really stupid. Like in the first race I did, coming through center S, then the long left, like I just really slow on the apex. So around he's outside and he just comes up a little bit, just taps me. And then I, as I'm going past him and then I get the penalty. It's just really stupid. But, um, I suppose, you know, if you're starting in the mid-pack, you're often in and around it. You're more likely to to be involved. Right, I really need a pee. So I'll be back in just a moment before this race starts.
Okay. Can we please have a good race without a penalty? That would be great. That would be great. Oh, guys. Guys, guys, guys. moment. Don't you love it? Just want to check BBC News quickly. Or the sport. Wait, let me have a look. Liverpool lost 1-0. Oh, Danny Ings scored in the second minute. Suck it, Liverpool. God, man. When are United playing next? They could go top. That's mad. Fixtures. Honestly, what the f are we doing here? They're playing tomorrow against Burnley. Okay. Um, thank you, Atoti. Yeah, it was. Yeah, on what was it turn like seven? The tight right hander. I, I didn't even know he was going for that move, but I. I went round, yeah. There's no way I should have got the penalty for it. But there you go. That's Gran Turismo for you. Um, but yeah, it's just frustrating because. Like, if I. How much time did I lose from that penalty? It's a one second penalty, but how much time do you actually lose? I, I, I think you probably lose about one and a half seconds, I'd say. And if I didn't lose that, I probably would have been in the slipstream of Ollie there. But it is what it is. Do you use the Fanatec DD1? Yes, I do, indeed. The PS4 one, although you can use it on PC as well. So. Yeah, and, and you lose the toe, so there's the the loss of that as well to consider. All right, what have we got now? Miro, isn't it? Um, PX cams in here, fifteenth. I'm gonna go medium again, I think, from this position. Yeah, I'll go, I'll go medium, I think. Why do you use both feet while driving? Well, what, why wouldn't you? <laughs> Don't you, you always do that. I'd, I'd like to know which car you, you drive that only requires one foot. <laughs> I don't know that car. What's my brake bias? Um, so, in the races I've been doing today, I've put it on like one or two to the front, but I think minus one in the Peugeot is about right. Your CPM favorite racing film of all time. Um, oh, I don't know, I can't really remember too many. I haven't watched that many of to be honest. I kind of like Le Mans 66, which was out last year, but I haven't watched many racing films if I'm honest. Devon, thank you for the donation, mate. Let's burn some fuel. Thank you, Just Tong. I'm going for the night. Thanks for the stream and concert. Thank you, mate. Thanks for the donation. Thanks for tuning in, mate. I do appreciate that. I'm going to leave... Um, I'm going to leave the brake balance on zero for this race. I 
suppose on an automatic car, yeah, you could use use one foot, I guess, yeah. So I might, these guys behind might have soft tyres, so if they go past and drive off to the distance, we don't have to panic just yet. trying to gauge shoes on what tyre. I say top four are on softs. I say Ollie's probably on softs. Miro's probably on mediums. These guys behind are on mediums, I think. That would be my judgement. I'm not in the toe, unfortunately. I don't know if Dino might, he might be on softs, I'm not sure. I'll say Miro's definitely on mediums. Guy in sixth place. We have a casualty.
Steve Gaming is very quick. going to fight him. He was quicker than me so we can just get into his toe. the long game on this one. If we can get onto Mira by the end of lap six, that might be good. Oh, he's wide. Come on, mate, I hyped you up. Get good. This is the guy that this is the guy who had that accident. He's on soft tires, no doubt. So if he go, if he goes for it, I'm not gonna. Overcook that, just a jiffy. Yeah, so I say the top five are on softs. Plus the guy behind me. The rest on mediums. Seems to be how it is. That was really slow. Still salvage a decent result here. Where did I start? Eighth, I think. Can't even remember now. Come on. Who's out on the track? We, okay, we got some clear air here, I think. Oh no, who's that? Don't know who that is. So we don't lose too much time to them. Let's 
kind of frustrating how they've got in the middle of our group. Okay, got past them. Didn't lose too much time there. We we're alright. Just lost the toe though, that's a bit annoying. Hey, thank you, Peter Barrett. Cheers, Mum. Right, on the hunt now. So that super in fifth is on mediums. Well, as are the top four. The top four are all on mediums. So now it's just time to put in the laps and see what we can get. Five laps to go, including this one. Six seconds off the lead. Peter again. Thank you, Devon, again. Hey, Tichney, how you doing, man? Good to see you, bro. leading fight is not that far away. They're fighting too much again. It's 
shame I, I lost the toe. So that's costing me big time, eh? Three laps to go. Well, that lead fight is very interesting. I reckon Miro could do this. He's on the best tyre in fourth. He's third. Oh mate, that leading fight looks very interesting, my god, and they're going to start fighting even more, surely. Just didn't quite have the pace in this second stint to keep up, it's a bit frustrating. Kicking off. It really is kicking off. My God. Look at that four way fight for first on the last lap. Break that early. <laughs> I guess I can't have a penalty free race, can I? Steve Game is going to win it in the Jag. I did think he was quick. Ripperoni Pizza. Well, I should get seventh here anyway. Steve Gaming. My God, in the F type.
Oh, God. I thought Miro was going to have that. I want to save that replay, kind of see what happened. Because I think any one of five people could have won that. <laughs> Yeah, that jag looked really good. Anyway, look. I went on the internet this week and I found this. No, I'm not going to I'm not going to take my car on a track, um, but I might rent someone else's car, you know. I'm not yeah, I'm, I don't really fancy taking my car on a circuit to be honest. Not my daily driver. Okay, let's have a look at that. That was interesting. That was a really weird race. Like it all came together at the end. I everyone <laughs> seemed to converge on the lead and all of a sudden there's a five way fight. Nine thousand dollars a corner. Okay, Titch, yeah. You got a deal, mate. Just two corners though, mate. I'm sure that's enough. Let's have a look at this. Um, I just didn't. I didn't quite have the speed. I I was like, maybe if I had just kept in the toe, that would have helped. But Are you Joe, you should be able to copy my brake markers just by using the hundred or there's already boards. Like, you don't need the cones. Look, at, look. There's a 150 board. Just, just use those as references. That's all you need. Um, let's just whip it forward to like the end. Because I just wanted to see that. So the last couple of laps. So that's Steve Gaming going through. Um, just make sure that. Yeah, he's doing a better job with tire wear as well. So at this point, go past Dino, go past Ollie, and then, so two laps to go, let's just run this, just watch it, mirror up the inside of Callum, Bela could try to go around, is that going to work? No. Steve Gaming looks for that, goes around the outside. Not going to work. Oh, bit of contact. So, this is on to the last lap. Oh, okay. Let's just have a look at that then. Um, that was Miro and Inman. Yeah, he spun into his path. Miro didn't spin him. Five seconds. That's Callum goes through. Let's see how Steve Gaming capitalised from that then. So Bela goes wide. So he nips off the inside. Goes past in man. Miro gets the five. He's up into third. Callum goes defensive. Puts up the inside. That is a really good move. Muscled him out a little bit on the exit, but I think he had the inside. So that's how he got into the lead. Mate. 
Yeah, Steve Gaiman did really well. Yeah. And that's just a racing incident, that is. Steve Game, look at his tyres compared to mine. Yeah, it's a lot better. So with the BM, like, oh, it's on mediums, 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 softs. But yeah, it's like that's why I think maybe I'm just trying to think like the seventh lap on soft tyres is quite a slow lap. Like the car doesn't like that lap. Like you do seem to lose out on that, those last sort of couple of laps, last one or two laps on softs. They just begin to go off a little bit. But um, Steve Gaming, I mean, fair play. <laughs> he came through from like 12th or something, or something, or like 10th. It wasn't that near the front. He did really well. That was a, that was a good race by him. Okay, everyone. I am going to call it a day. Thank you so much for watching as always. I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, it's been a pleasure. Um, not the best races, but... Well, I mean, that Interlagos race has really good potential. You just have to have a... I mean, that last race showed that you can have a close race at the end. Um, so there's definitely potential there to have a good one. But... Um, unfortunately, we <laughs> kept getting penalties. Um, that's all from me. Everyone, thank you so much for watching as always. Um, well, take care. Have a good day. Have a good week. Have a good year. Let's have a good year, everyone. Take care. Where's my outro? I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye. Wow. Give you the rocket launcher. There you go. <laughs> Wait. I'll give you all the memes. Screw it. Bit Toto as well. Wow, guy again. Wow. Very different sort of outro for you today. There you go. One more out. One more. Rocket launcher. <laughs> all right, everyone. Have a good one. You've seen this outro a million times. Actually, let's leave the song on. It's a good song. Let it run through to the end. Wow. Alright everyone, have a good one, I'll catch you all very soon.